the mock crochet in a next in the mock crochet in a nutshell a summary wherever your working yarn is that is peg two so this is where my working yarn is that's peg two I need to go back to peg one and I'm gonna wrap peg one peg two and peg three and I'm going to knit off one two three now this is my new peg two and I'm gonna do the same thing again I'm going in that direction so to find peg one because this is peg two and I'm going in that direction so my peg one is in the opposite direction so it's here I'm gonna wrap peg one two and three and knit off that's the mock crochet in summary I start the row by skipping the first peg, this one that's right here, and I won't start the stitch pattern either one of these, I have to start it here. I do the same thing on the other side, I slip the first one, I knit that next one, and that's where I start the stitch pattern, right there. I try to mark where I start the stitch pattern on both ends, so again I'm going to slip that first stitch and then I'm going to knit the next two. Keep in mind what direction I'm knitting in. So I'm knitting this stitch and then I'm going to knit off this one because this is where I'm going to start my stitch pattern right here. Um, again that's why I mark uh, that peg. It reminds me that that's where my stitch pattern begins. And now my working yarn is on peg two. And how does this stitch work? Wherever your working yarn is, that is your peg two. So you need to go back to peg one, which is here, and you're going to wrap peg one, two, and three. One, two, and three are going to be wrapped. And you knit off one two and peg three all right you're going to knit them off and remember that the rule is wherever your yarn is that is your peg two so this now is your new peg two and if you notice this is where you start it so you've only moved forward only one peg even though you've knitted three of them you only move forward one okay so we're going to do the same thing we're going to take our working yarn that's on peg two and we're going to wrap peg one two and three and you're going to knit off pegs one two and three Thank you. 